been invited down to go view a jewelry house in Paris. They were doing an event in London. I was like, I'm actually in Paris. And they were like, I'll come in to see us. So I was like, okay. So we're gonna head there today and then we've got the Louvre later on and then we're gonna have a really chill night because we have party too hot. <laughs> um, so I'll show you my outfit in a minute, but yeah. We just got this cream little top on and a black skirt. I was just saying to Georgia, like we really didn't plan for it to be this hot. Like my wardrobe is too warm to wear. So I'm really struggling for outfits in Paris. We're just getting a tour of the Malario house in Paris. Isn't this place beautiful? Look at this staircase. Just seeing all the jewels. It's got me wanting a tiara. I'll show you some clips now. We've just gone downstairs to like the art channel. So that's great because as it's a familial uh, oh, wow. company, they have kept like so all cool. the archives oh on the my ground. God, this, this book is from 1789. So it's the year of the French Revolution. Jewels we made at the time. So at the time we were really like the jeweler of the kings and queens uh, in Europe. That can make like all your look. Um, yeah, they would look beautiful. Like he's from Italy. There we go. Wow. Do these new collections. Wow. Yeah, this is actually an old piece. So this was a tiara at the time, and that then became two brooches. So it's a piece from the 19th century. So we've decided to be very cultural today. I'm very not currently in the Louvre, trying to figure out what it's all about. <laughs> Georgia, no, I'm what do you reckon these statues are all around? I reckon they are... I really recommend getting those headphones and talk you through it because we haven't got clear. Or even just a fan. <laughs> it's really hot. But it's beautiful. It's a really beautiful it's place. So beautiful. It's so clean. Look, look at this. Fantastic head sculpture. Look at, look at his tiny, his tiny penis. Oh, it's got, dang it's got really dangly balls. Georgia. There's lots of penises. Well, tiny penis so I don't want to be scared. Enjoy it. It's small. Look how fantastic the ceiling is. Very nice ceiling. What are you wearing today, Laura? I'm wearing Georgia's Fendi bag. <laughs> this skirt is a good one. It's from a ball. Like, you can press it on your dress and down. This is sheen. Oh, that's a good one for Jean. Um, Sandals are misguided. This is a massage. And a ponytail? Ponytail's for you. Currently in this section of the Louvre, you probably recognise it. It's kind of cool. Look how cute this place is. This is Lulu's. We've just booked it for George's last night. So nice. Guys, we are back in. Guess what? <laughs> Guess where we are? We are by Louvre again. It's one of our favourite spots. Guys, I don't know how good Paris content's gonna be from now on. My camera is hanging on for dear life by one screw. <laughs> but just how beautiful is Paris? I mean, like everywhere you go, there's like beautiful architecture. Stunning. The Louvre, I was a bit upset about. We went, I wanted a picture in the cafe. One of the reasons why I went to the Louvre. Um, it shook before we got there. We got so bloody lost at the Louvre. How lost did we get? <laughs> I just couldn't even appreciate the stunning stone penises because we just got so lost. But yeah, really loving this heat wave we're having in Paris. It is so, so hot. Actually, this is meant to be a really nice cafe. Can't work out why. Apparently it is. This is meant to be a nice cafe here. We haven't tried it yet, have we? Just out shooting some looks in Paris today. Thought I'd show you this one now. Tonight we've got some feathers because, you know, why not? <laughs> George's Valentino belt, which I feel like I might have to get. And then the Eiffel Tower. We are about to tackle <laughs> Galleries Lafayette, the big one, and the H&M we just walked past is so huge. Look at this. It is huge. Galleries Lafayette. 
God, this is the biggest H&M ever. Look how epic this is. So we have just come to Gallery de Lafayette today. Look how epic this is. This is insane. I've just tried on a pair of Louis Vuitton sunglasses, which looks so good. I um, forgot my passport though. We now need our passports to get to tax back, is that right? Yeah. I don't really understand, but I might, need a I might have to come again. This shop, as I said, French do like department stores very, very well. Guys, I just said oh, to Georgia. Yeah, yeah, should we go get one? Yeah. I just said to Georgia, let's go up there to take a picture. It's like got like a little jutty outy thing here. <laughs> we don't know about that. I might get in Pataka. <laughs> no, I said. <laughs> I usually get in vertigo, but that's not the word I'm looking for. It really is not. What's the one I... Vertigo. Vertigo, that's it. <laughs> This is the face of completion. <laughs> we did it. What are you wearing? George's jacket, which I tried to order myself, but I couldn't get. Um, My wardrobe is your wardrobe, honey. These trousers are, I can't remember, ASOS, I think. Oh, we just got into the chainers. George's Balenciaga, Versace <laughs> sunglasses. So guys, it's another night. It's another camp. We were on a place. We're on our way. No, we're on our way. <laughs> we're on our way to a place called Coco Paris. Um, we will show you our outfits. <laughs> Gosh, you can really see my baguette, maybe. <laughs> ate a whole baguette today. Um, literally bought it from the shop and ate the whole thing. <laughs> yeah, it's been a carb feast of a day, hasn't it? A week. <laughs> but we'll show you our outfits when we get there. tonight I did we say to the camera beforehand that we wanted to party till 5 a.m. I was like I want to be dancing on tables because in 2019 before the pandemic me and Georgia came to Paris had an epic night out it was the one when I took her when her screwed her over and we went to Paris on a girls trip and just partied really hard so we wanted to re recreate that night I can officially tell you it is 5 30 a.m. we have just walked through the door I feel like the story time can happen tomorrow because right now I need to go to bed. <laughs> Honestly, how wild was tonight? She's in bed already. She's gone. You're right. I don't know the last clip that. I know I do know the last clip. But it was at 5:30 this morning. I told you to do a story time, but I don't think I can. Did you? You I did. Um, I don't think you can do a story time. <laughs> It's just too much. I wouldn't even know where to start. I wouldn't know where to start. So maybe I'll fill you in another time. 
but um, we were just off to we book we before we went out to 5 30 last night we'd already booked tonight so we have to go out <laughs> yeah. and it's also george's it's last also night the only one time we've actually booked, booked. so we booked lulu's which is like the restaurant that everyone goes to by the louvre we're matching again i've got this fluffy blazer on which i love it's from yeah, I think this is from plt no nasty girl. girl yeah we're feeling very i actually wasn't drunk last night but it's the lack of sleep for me Oh, that's the thing, it's like the tiredness is next level and we have naps. Today. I'm gonna say you probably had a hangover. Oh, I had definitely had a hangover. I don't understand why me and George go out sometimes and she's on like, she's on like a good eight or nine and I'm like still on a two. But then other times you have one. Yeah, like the And it's like, yeah. <laughs> Very weird. I was definitely sober last night. Um, but yeah, we're just gonna go up. Well, I think we should party till 5 a.m. again. I mean, it's your last night. <laughs> Where are we going? We just get you a red ball and you can be oh, on again. <laughs> I'm drinking vodka red ball last should we, night. Should we end up in chasing Billy's room again? Yeah. <laughs> I just bleep that out. <laughs> Why are you so brown? I'm so white. I think it's just our colour palette. <laughs> I'm feeling tired, I'm but yeah. Feeling tired. So we are in the most beautiful restaurant tonight. We just sat in the We have a view of the Eiffel Tower over here somewhere. But look, say hi. <laughs> She's busy in red. But it is so beautiful here. It would make the most beautiful day. If you, you want some special. I am on a day. <laughs> um, I just went over Georgia in the car and she was like, oh, what did you say? I'm like, oh, my personal face. <laughs> I was like, there's never been any personal space ever. But this is, I can't get over this restaurant. It's so gorgeous. I'll show you a little bit of the Eiffel Tower view in a minute. We just finished up dinner and we have walked out and the Louvre is looking so gorgeous at night. The people in it today, they haven't cordoned it off, have they? The Rayland. So gorgeous everywhere. There she is. <laughs> what are you wearing? I'm wearing an oh separate separate. I'm wearing a nasty girl blazer. Shorts and me. This is a very rushed outfit of the day, Laura. <laughs> <laughs> I will get there.